on our trip from Lillehama to Rurus, we make a short break in Ringebu in order to visit the famous Stave Church. After Christianization, more than 1000 Stave Churches were built between the 10th and 15th century in Norway. In these days, only 28 of them remained, most of them in Norway. In the late afternoon we arrive at Pontana National Park. As the weather is fine we decide to make a short hike to a hill. The forest floor is covered with soft moss. Our destination today is the old mining town of Röros. On the way to the Smelt Hutch Museum, we pass the, uh, the old town of Röros. We visit the old church built 230 years ago. It's the third largest church of Norway. In the surroundings of Röros, 110,000 tons of copper were produced. Ten kilometer easterly of Röros, we visit the old Cooper mine. In the middle of the 17th century, when the mining work began, only up to 20 people lived here. Gabito, the reason for this was that this area is one of the coldest parts of Norway. The record temperature is minus 56 degrees. Now we follow the tracks of the old Cooper miners. In the beginning of mining, no pneumatic drills were available. They used fire in order to crack the rock. The cooper was conditioned in melting huts close to the mine. These melting huts need an enormous lot of energy produced by water electricity and the forest of the surroundings. This model shows 
what enormous quantities of raw materials were used in order to produce that small quantity of copper. Just in one week. At 3 o'clock we visit the casting of souvenir copper ingots. 